When it comes to creating your own look and feel for your edits, one of the best tools is the Split Toning tool. So that's what we're going to take a look at now. So firstly, what is split toning? Well, split toning is where you apply a color to the highlights and another color to the darker or shadow areas of your image. This gives you the option of creating an image or set of images that really stand out against just a standard edit. This practice is particularly popular for things like weddings or portraits, so we'll take a look at how we use the tool now. First up, you want to produce a rough or base edit of the image that you want to use. After that's done, head to the split toning tab and open it up. You should see a few sliders under two different sections, highlights and shadows. Now, one of the most common color selections for this is teal and orange, and when used right, can be a really nice addition to your image. So we'll experiment with those two colors now. So first slide the top slider of highlights to the orange hue and slightly increase the saturation slider until you see some yellowy orange tones coming through your image. Now offset this by using the hue slider on the shadows to get it to a nice teal blue color and again increase the saturation of this one. You can experiment with lots of different color choices but it's always worth looking at complementary tones for your color choices and there are some good websites that give you these complementary colors based on your original color choice. I do hope you found this tip useful. Do experiment with the hues and saturation for both the highlights and the shadows within split toning. For more great tips on Lightroom, do check out the rest of the series with Wex Photo Video.